Welcome to video on bootstrap simulation in a regression in econometrics or in any other analysis. So today I am going to discuss uh, how to do bootstrap simulation. In Monte Carlo simulation we discussed that we know the underlying probability model and we have generated errors here from standard normal distribution but in bootstrap simulation we'll assume these residuals as our population this sample of size 20 will be considered as our population and we'll resample from this sample and every time we'll calculate a sample of size 20 for of these residuals we'll add in sales hat we'll have a new value of simulated sale and will regress this sale simulated on advertising every time we'll have a new slope which we call slope simulated and uh, in uh, main main uh, the point is that this sample of residuals will be considered as population from which we'll keep on generating sample of size 20 again and again with replacement some residuals will be repeated but slightly different values will be added in these sales and this will lead to new values of sales simulated bootstrap simulation is very useful when sample size is so small uh, particularly when you, we do panel unit root testing co-integration or in medicine we have uh, data on rare uh, diseases animals or some other uh, you see some re, uh, some uh, uh, some other related data in social social sciences where you cannot have a large sample so uh, uh, if sample size is small critical values for one sample to another will be different so if i have a sample of size 20 you have a sample of size 20 with slightly different values your critical values your underlying distribution may not be the same so let's see how we do this bootstrap simulation i have already calculated this slope on uh, by regressing sales on advertising and intercept by regressing sales on advertising and now we shall calculate uh, uh, sales estimated this is my regression line our sales hat will generate residuals here last time we have generated here errors from standard normal distribution now we can take a sample of size 20 with replacement from this uh, these original residuals and you'll see that some of the residuals will be repeated uh, more than once some will be repeated uh, missed out 0 0.11 0 0.11 so this is here you will find some 0 0.11 and it is repeated maybe two times three times next time I will do some other residuals will be repeated and every time we will have a new slightly different values of sales and we will regress this sales simulated on advertising when I regress it again since these values keep on changing so slope will keep on changing oops so you see every time this slope will be different again it will be different and you can keep on pressing F9 to generate new uh, values no there are different ways to do th uh, th this uh, generate this slope but at the moment we are going to use bootstrap add-in basically which is available in excel uh, you can download the link uh, the same link which i have used for monte carlo simulation add-in no this is my original sample from which i'll generate uh, new uh, bootstrap residuals i'll keep on adding in sales sim and uh, at the moment i am basically doing because I have to generate residuals from this one this slope will be more exactly same as the previous one but no we'll see the magic so you see we'll go to files options add-ins add-ins go here 
browse where your bootstrap add-in is and no let's go add-ins okay add-ins sorry for keeping you on waiting so we have here bootstrap add-ins yes okay no I have this bootstrap add-in here no I have original sample which is my residuals and we'll take keep on taking uh, a sample of size 20 from these residuals and I am going to replace these residuals so at the moment and what the cell we have to track the cell we have to track is your slope coefficient if I take 1000 or uh, the 10,000 it will take lot of time so just for demonstration I am going to use it only 100 samples and it is asking that it will be this is how how it will proceed and you will have no hundred slope values generated if you do thousand times thousand times ten thousand times uh, it will generate your slope simulated values and it will find out you can make its uh, distribution so this is how your bootstrap simulation helps you to find out the underlying distribution for any statistics to generate critical values uh, please do this practice uh, I hope you learn a lot this is my sampling distribution of slope estimator whose values from one sample to another every time we have generated simulated values every time we'll have a different value of slope and now its distribution is here for 100 repetitions which took 30 seconds you can generate it more number of times thank you for watching I hope it will it will uh, help you a lot in generating simulated critical values for